I haven't done a tea video in a long time, and I have a couple new teas, so I thought that I would show you my new tea, and I'm going to drink some. I'm going to use my little steaming bowl and this teapot, which I forgot about because I've never actually, I don't think I've used it. I'll show you the tea first. Ah, if you hear some noises, it's there's something going on outside, and also the kettle is boiling in the kitchen. <clears throat> so this one I have shown you. My very first tea video was this tea, Forever Nuts. It's very sweet and delicious. It's so good. I had to go out and buy some more of it myself, but I just got it in a bag. Uh, I got 50 grams. I think she gave me kind of the bottom of the bin because it's all very small pieces. They're all crushed. Oh, there's some big ones too. It smells wonderful like almonds. I wonder if I could eat them right now. Mmm. Really, really good. So there's that one. Because uh, I think this is all crumbled up, it sometimes it all falls out of here, out of the edge, and so it doesn't really work very well with this. I need to use my French press. My other tea, which I think I'll make today, I got it as a gift. And I was like, oh, this is a wonderful little gift. It's goji pop, fruit infusion. Legend has it that Li Ching Yong lived for 256 years. His secret was goji berries. Your secret? This sweet pink tea, caffeine free. But it has apples, whole goji berries, hibiscus blossom, rose hips, reading this backwards. <laughs> Honey blue melon. Cubes. <laughs> Lemon oil. Marigold petals. It needs a bit more. You need two teaspoons per cup and steep five to seven minutes. Gel, blah, blah, blah. 70 grams. Looks kind of the same as the other one. Like a little bit so it has some leafy things in it, as well as you can see the whole berries in there and some other red things and nuts. It smells really fruity. It's really good. Okay. So this teapot, I have it. It's one of the ones where the cup sits in. Um, I think it's my old roommate's, and she left it at the apartment and didn't want it, I guess, so now I have it. She's my friend, and I told her about it, but I don't think she really cares. I think she drinks coffee, not much tea. I think I saw a honeydew piece in there. One more. It's kind of smaller one. Let's see if this will fit. <gasps> it won't fit. I have to steep it like this. I guess I should have realized that when I was just lying in here. Hmm. Maybe I'll make it directly in the cup. Some dust went through. That's okay.
dusty it is. I've got some water on my keyboard. See the berries are already turning it pink. I'm dressed up right now because I'm going to be distributing some resumes around to try and get a part-time job for the summer. Pay off some debts. So I thought I'd wear this nice skirt. Just maybe it doesn't look so great right now, but it fits me nicely. Do you guys like the kind of vinyl-y fabric sound like this? One of my best friends from ever since I was little, she really didn't like that sound, like the sound on raincoats and other things that are vinyl. She said it gave her goosebumps, but maybe not in a good way. I like it. in these bags because my kitchen is rather small and my storage for my teas is, is difficult. I really love the cans that it comes in, but this saves a lot more space. In Canada, we just had a long weekend. I think there was probably one in the States as well, um, Memorial Day. We had Victoria that day, which is a celebration of old queen's birthday a bunch of queens ago and you celebrate that by going to your cottage and sitting out by the lake and letting off fireworks and I didn't go out to cottage country this year for the first time I think ever I stayed in the city and I just went to the park and hung out in the sun then I watched fireworks from my apartment last night. It was so noisy. It reminded me of popcorn. There are lots of little pieces that kind of escape my tea steeper and float around. This is a really cheap steeper. I think it was $4. I think this is almost ready. Mm. Good. I think I'm going to enjoy this now. I'm just going to put the empty one. drink my tea with ease. And before I go dropping off resumes, I'm going to drink this tea. And oops, there we go. Uh, finish reading Game of Thrones because I'm almost done. I have this much left. Which is about 150 pages left. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. I hope you have a good afternoon. Good night, good morning.